Today I'm headed to Park Meadows to my primary care doctor who is at the C Medicine Women's Integrated Services and Health at Park Meadows, also known as the WISH Clinic, to have a primary care visit, a well check, and to also try out the new InBody 380 machine. Um, this machine is a scale that does more than just tell you what your body weight is. It breaks down your weight into different areas such as your water weight, your lean muscle mass, as well as your fat mass. First of all, we're just so happy to have this machine here because it, it gives us another tool in kind of like people's weight loss journeys. Um, it's just another tool for the toolbox. You know, people are looking at the scale, they're looking at the number on the scale, um, which, you know, obviously there's some proof and evidence that that is necessary to monitor, but it's not the only thing. Um, there's a common misconception that BMI is like the best marker and we're realizing that the BMI is not the best marker. Um, different people have different body types and so one person could have a BMI um, equal to another person. One could be completely healthy and muscular and fit and the other is undernourished or overnourished. So you have to kind of take the numbers of the BMI with a grain of salt. So we see the InBody as a tool for weight loss. So we tell you, if you're gonna come in and use it in that manner, you're probably gonna take more than one assessment. So if that's the case, then we want you to have reproducible results. So we typically have you change into a gown. We have you empty your bladder. Women shouldn't be on their periods just because it can affect the results. Then we have you step on the machine. We make sure your feet and hands are clean. And then you basically follow the prompts that are on the end body. It takes probably less than 30 seconds for it to read. Step off, print out your results, and we go over on it. So the insights are really interesting. I've always been really aware of what my body mass is, but it was really cool to see where those three main segments of muscle, fat, and water laid out on the, on the chart. Um, what I really like about my insights were that I now have a really clear, uh, actionable plan on how I can reach my goals. Um, before, I was kind of guesstimating on what would be best about how many calories I should eat. My printout told me exactly how many calories I should eat minimum, how many calories I should eat to maintain my weight. And so Devin and I were able to look in between those two numbers to find out that ideal caloric intake to lose weight so safely, which is just so fantastic. The InBody score, um just gives us like an idea of how your muscle and your fat, like what the balance is within your body. Okay. Um, the closer to 100 you are, the better. Okay. I think ideally it should be greater than 80. Like okay. that's like a good number to be at. Something else that is really great is I have um, an actionable plan on increasing my leg muscle mass, which in theory should also increase my basal metabolic rate if I increase my muscle mass in my legs, which is an opportunity that I have um, according to the scale. So um, it's just really great because now I can take those insights to the gym, to my everyday life, and feel like I'm actually working on a plan that my doctor is okay with, um, that I'm okay with, and that um, I should be able to see results with. That's why this is so cool when you have something you can work on that's actionable like your legs because you can see the benefit not only in raising that skeletal muscle mass but also in raising your resting metabolic rate. I think it is a good tool because I mean depending on where you are in your menstrual cycle depending on where you are in your kind of hormone journey I mean we see so many women here in perimenopause and menopause and so I feel like it's really helpful for them too because we're always talking about muscle mass we're talking about building muscle, muscle mass um, to be able to help with general health bone health weight maintenance weight loss um, and to be able to actually have a way to measure this I think is really helpful um, Doing it one time, it gives you a baseline. It's it's nice to see the numbers, but the real benefit in it is doing it and following it, and so you have you can trend how your numbers are going.